The Not Impossible Foundation was established to create solutions to impossible challenges. The iWriter is the first of those challenges. The iWriter is a low-cost eye-tracking device which enables people with paralysis or other disabilities to operate a computer by using their eyes. It is constructed from easily obtainable objects including a pair of ordinary sunglasses, some IR LED lights, and a standard computer web camera. All the parts are made out of miscellany. <laughs> it can be built for under $50 and works in tandem with free open source software. So we have a pair of glasses with a small camera that is taking in video image of the eye and we're using some image processing algorithms to find the center of the pupil and track its movements. The iWriter was originally conceived to assist Los Angeles-based artist Temp1 to be able to draw again after becoming completely paralyzed with Lou Gehrig's disease. Working closely with Temp, a group of artists, producers, and programmers created the first ever open source device for paralyzed people to be able to communicate again using only their eyes. The beauty of this prototype is that the technology will be absolutely free and openly available for anyone to download and use right away. Look at the screen over here and attempt to draw the alphabet again, but in between every letter, imagine that you're starting the pen drawing by looking at the TV screen. Right now, there's amazing technology like this, but it's big and super expensive, and you almost always have to go through insurance companies to get it. We designed something that was light, cheap, and totally accessible. The beauty of this prototype is that the technology will be absolutely free and openly available for anyone to download and use right away. Since I've been able to draw again, I've had the freedom to explore my ideas and express myself more completely. We were the, for the first time in, in Tony's room and set up the software for him. And I think it was tough seeing a lot of the problems that exist that we didn't see back home. So it means we have more work to do. As the first project of the Not Impossible Foundation, we developed the iRider with Tempt in order to help him achieve the impossible, to draw again after seven years. Now we want to continue to work with others on its amazing potential. So by teaming up with a like-minded sponsor, we will immediately be able to finalize the software and get a thousand iWriters to the people who need them. People suffering from Lou Gehrig's disease, like Tempt, people paralyzed from spinal cord injuries, injured war veterans, and the list goes on and on. So if you or an organization you know of can help move the iWriter project forward, please contact us at notimpossiblefoundation.org.